Okay guys, I want to show you how to set up your bulk mailer, uh, which is uh, the solo email sender that's a part of your uh, Build My Income Daily um, li uh, Lifetime Pro Membership. Uh, it's very simple um, for the software. I mean, once you download the file, it's going to give you a zip like this. Um, if you're looking at this video, then you should already uh, unzip the file. Well, what you're going to then do next is you're going to see um, a file that looks like this right here. Uh, solo email sender .php. Now you don't need to edit this. <clears throat> you don't need to do anything to this file right here. Okay. What you're gonna need to do is log into your uh, hosting account. Uh, wherever it is that you have hosting, um, you're gonna log in and you're gonna upload this file uh, to your hosting account. Uh, for those of you that are using uh, Windows, I'm gonna uh, show you an easy way to log in uh, to your hosting account. For those of you that use uh, Mac or some um, some uh, something else, um, you can use uh, FileZilla or you know whatever FTP protocol software that you use. Um, you can use that in order to log into your uh, into your hosting account. So what you're going to do for those of you that are using Windows, um, you're going to open up a document. Uh, it doesn't matter which document it is. Uh, for those of you that are using Windows 8, you're probably going to have to go to Download, or if you can go to um, one of the tiles on your computer that says uh, documents or pictures uh, and it gives you a folder that looks like like this right here what you're going to then do is delete uh, whatever is in this browser right here see where it says uh, libraries and documents you're going to delete that out of there whatever you're saying in there and then what you're going to then do is go to your FTP uh, um, login in my case my own is going to be FTP dot whatever my um, your well my website is and that's <clears throat> You also be the same thing, um, depending on how you have your hosting. Uh, they should give that to you uh, once you once you sign up for hosting. They send you an email with the login information. Um, so it's going to be FTP dot your domain name dot whatever extension it is dot com dot net uh, whatever it is or whatever the login information is that they give you. So then you're going to do you're going to hit enter, and that's going to bring you uh, maybe to a blank screen or in my case it says incoming. Um, what you're going to then do is right click in this uh, blank space and you're going to then go to login as and you're going to have to put in the username and password in order to log in. Now I already have my own save so I'm going to just go ahead and log in and depending on how many domains you have it'll probably bring or if you have a cPanel it'll probably bring you to a route like this. Okay. Um, what you're going to then have to do now is click on uh, public underscore HTML okay you double click on that and then you're gonna look for um, whatever uh, website is that you have in there if you don't have any other uh, website hosting on this uh, inside that account it'll probably just bring it up and you'll see all these uh, uh, files or folders that looks like this right here but it, I mean it's not gonna be exactly I mean like what you're seeing here so then you will have to decide on which domain um, if you have more than one domain uh, what were you gonna put it on in my case, I'm going to just go ahead and um, go to uh, over here um, to where it says um, build my income daily. And what I'm going to then do is I'm going to just go ahead and create a directory. Okay. And I'm going to name this uh, directory uh, solo emails. Okay. You can name it whatever you want to name it. So I'm going to just go ahead and go in here. Okay, so now as you can see, I have a blank uh, um, folder here that's on my hosting account. Okay, this is this is a, a, a subdirectory um, that that's inside the uh, buildmyincomedaily.com uh, um, host uh, domain. Okay, the hosting. So what you're gonna then do is you're gonna you're gonna look for the the file that you have on your desktop. Okay, and then all you have to do is uh, left click it, hold it, and then drag it over into that folder and then let it go and it's going to automatically upload onto your server now what you're going to then have to do is you're going to have to locate um, this <clears throat> this file right here okay it's very simple uh, um, in most cases all you have to do is just uh, right click on it go to uh, I'm sorry left click on it uh, well actually it is right click uh, right click on it go to uh, name um, or rename you copy this piece right here okay and then you just paste it into the window over here behind um, where, wherever that directory is and it's going to give you this long URL right here the only piece that you want is this piece right here for your domain okay 
and let me put that up into the window um, and this is only going to be for demo purposes guys uh, this uh, file is going to be removed um, so what I'm going to then do is show you uh, what it looks like okay let me um, bring this up so you can see my browser okay so as you can see right here this is my domain it says buildmyincomedaily.com forward slash solo email and then it says uh, forward slash again uh, solo email sender now you could rename this and I highly recommend you do um, once you uh, upload it okay you can upload that if you need help I just contact me I'll be happy to, to help you uh, upload this I'll, I'll show you how to um, how to do it so once you get to that you can just hit enter on your keyboard and it's going to automatically bring you to the website that looks like this right here it's already uh, set up and everything you don't have to do anything to it now in order for you to start using this um, it's very simple okay this is uh, the send button over here <clears throat> and if you hover over it it gives you um, a, a, a little menu explanation of what it is okay the reset button um, when you want to reset um, after finish sending um, and then the preview if you want to preview your emails okay and then over here the status uh, which would give you the status after it's finished sending it'll give you the status of the emails uh, that, well, the, the, the email that you send out um, and over here these are the tags that you can use inside your messages <clears throat> when you're sending out your, your, um, your, your emails um, if you have uh, a list of uh, emails that contains the first and last name of the person um, of the e uh, inside the emails as you're sending them out you can tag them where this would automatically put their name uh, in the email as it's going out and I'll show you how to do that right now okay um, this first window right here is where you put your, your email list uh, the other one here is where you put uh, who is coming from uh, and then along with your name over here okay and then the subject of your email that you're sending out and then this is where you would put the, the message um, off your email so I'm gonna go ahead and grab um, one of my emails and I'm gonna go ahead and show you uh, how that works right now so grab some of my emails uh, these are my emails right here I already have a pre-written um, uh, subject so I'm gonna just go ahead and grab this is my subject line and as you can see let me put this in the body here so you can see it um, you see right here the percentage this is gonna put the person's first name and then it says uh, would you um, with an extra 50 uh, to 100 USD um, per day uh, help you so this is my subject line so I'm gonna copy this uh, put this right here into my subject okay now where the email is gonna be coming from you can select uh, you know put whatever you want to put in there <coughs> I'm gonna just go ahead and select right here and I'm gonna put my name over here uh, which one of my emails okay and then I'm gonna grab the body of my email that I want to use uh, see right here I'm gonna just grab this right here okay and I'm gonna go ahead and paste this in here and if I scroll up you see right here where it says hi I'm gonna now grab this percentage code right here okay and put that right there and that's gonna automatically uh, put the person's name there okay and if, let me just uh, scroll this down a little bit here and <clears throat> as you can see um, right here okay so if I wanted to put um, the um, build my income daily in here so I just put uh, build my income daily dot com for my link you can just put that in there uh, but I'm gonna uh, bitly it um, so I could um, you know track on um, the clicks that I'm getting from um, from this uh, uh, email uh, as uh, once it sends out and people start clicking on it okay so now what I'm gonna do is grab my emails and put it into the uh, into the list section okay so these are my emails right here and for those of you that are using <coughs> excuse me the single opt-in uh, email capture pages in the uh, build my income daily system you're gonna be getting all those uh, leads coming directly into your inbox you can then copy them and save them in a format like this um, which is the email first, the, the first name, and then the last name. And then you can just, uh, on each line, um, you want to have uh, one person name. Like this is one person right here. This is another one over here. And you can just keep saving them and, and build a list that way. Um, this is the manual way of doing it. Um, but um, you can also do it the automated way if you have an autoresponder. But let me show you how to do this. So what you're going to then do is then copy them like this right here and you just copy all of them and you're gonna go back over to your bulk uh, email sender or the solo email sender 
and you're gonna just paste them in here okay and as you can see the format right here um, what's um, that they're in so I'll just come here and bring this up okay so it's gonna be the first uh, first the it's gonna be the email here okay and then it's gonna be um, a comma after the email and then first name comma last name and that's it okay and then you don't really need the um, unless you're <clears throat> gonna be using both um, uh, tags in here you don't really need the, the, la the last name it would not show up um, only whatever uh, tags that you use would actually show up in the email as it go out now let me go to preview so you can see what it looks like so if, you, if I go over here to preview um, it's gonna give me a pop-up and let me try this again and see if that uh, gives me the okay see how this is it right here um, what it looks like um, it's gonna this is a if, if you do the preview on it it's gonna show you uh, <clears throat> who it's coming from your email address here whatever email address you put in there um, whatever name that you put in there okay and then it's gonna show the first person in there so this is just a preview for the first person as you can see right here put their first and last name here um, their first name in the subject line and then if you look in the body of the ad um, right here it says hi and then it automatically puts the person name inside uh, the body of the ad so I can just close this um, after I see the preview you can see the layout however you paste it in there that's how it's going to show up okay uh, and it's text only you cannot put in HTML so I'm going to just close that and and as you can see right here it tells you how many um, how much uh, how many emails that you're going to send out so there's a contact list of 47 um, that I have in there right now and if you're going to be doing this I highly recommend keeping it under 300 and you want to check with your hosting account and see how many emails that you can send out every hour with HostGator you can do up to 300 an hour okay so I'm gonna just go ahead and click on send and you can come right over here and click on send and then what's gonna happen is as you can see right here you see them sending out um, and this is because I'm using Google Chrome um, on Firefox it normally pops up um, afterwards so as you can see right here, and it'll tell you if you have an error uh, inside if an uh, um, email did not go out or if, it's fa or if it failed, it'll tell you that right here. And, and as you can see right here, it just sent it all out, and it says, okay, 47, uh, was the last one, okay, and it, put the, um, it tells you right here the time that it was completed, okay? Um, whatever your computer time is, that's whatever time this populates right here. So that you can know, you can save this uh, for your next mail, and you know when you send it out, so you can just save that. Um, and it's just that simple, guys. I mean, that's it. I mean, all. You, I mean, this is a very simple software uh, piece of tool that you can use, um, and it comes in handy for those people that scrape emails. And I don't. Um, if you're going to be scraping emails, I recommend that you put um, a disclaimer uh, to the bottom of your email uh, when sending it out. So that's it uh, for the uh, website uh, Bulk Mailer, um, which is the, the My Solo Email Sender uh, script, guys. Very simple. Um, once again, uh, thank you, thank you for being a part of uh, the Build My Income Daily uh, system. If you have any questions, uh, please contact me. I'd be happy to help you. Or go to the uh, Facebook group uh, and uh, log in there and ask questions. Um, and I'm sure either myself or somebody else will be happy to help you out.